Sag Nasty. After Carlton, we moved over to, uh, I don't even know what that's called, Country Ridge? If, if, I think that's the second yeah. name. I think it was called something else before that. Stonebridge. Stonebridge Stone Manor. Bridge. Stonebridge Manor yeah. and then became Country Ridge. Okay. So we moved way on the other side of almost, the, not the county, I guess, but pretty far away from Carlton. Very um, far, very far. Yeah. Far. To a apartment complex, which for me was the Sherwood School District. Oh, and yeah. it is for you too because we did go to yeah. elementary school together for one year. So you went to oh, Sherwood after, yeah, one year, yep. Yeah. Um, so you switched schools. Do you remember switching schools? Like, what I'm really curious about is that again, my memories don't really. I don't have memories of a uh, a mother and father. I always only have memories of divorce. Do you remember this moment where it's like you're gonna move? And dad's not coming, and you're going to be going to a new school, da da da. Like, there's this, this huge change in your life. Do you remember that transition? Yeah, I, I do. I remember, you know, going to Carlton. I didn't, I didn't really love it. Um, and so um, I didn't hate it, but I didn't really love it. And so, um, yeah, I, the, uh, I don't remember like the exact day, but I do remember being at a different school. Um, Stonebridge is really, again, still kind of out in the country, you know, it's out on the edge of town. Um, I remember it being, and I think the thing with the parents is that I remember is that they were, I was, uh, what I believed was that they were separated. And so, yeah, yeah. Um, not, that's not what we were told to, for many, many years. Yeah. Yeah. For many years. Uh, they were separated. So you didn't really so maybe we, pay attention as much as like, oh, that's nothing. Well, well in that, you know, I'm at a new school, but I would spend, you know, two weeks, with mom and then two weeks with dad and so it, it just floated back and forth so it felt like they um you know they, they would do um you know we go camping together we would do vacations we they were very cordial with each other um they just weren't living together and so i had always had in my head that maybe they would you know get back together because they got along every time i was with them like they seemed to get along and you know everything's wow. fine dad would go down to detroit for holidays with us yeah, you know, with with uh, mom's side of the family, uh, his side of the family, we didn't see them that much. Um, he wasn't really as close with them, but um, he, you know, he was always, you know, he was with us at holidays, and and um, so it doesn't, it wasn't a, to me a traditional um, divorce where you know everything is cut off. And it's just ah. very, very. So you didn't very get like traumatized at that moment. Mm -hmm. You don't even no, really no. remember, like, suddenly you're living apart from dad because, like, you saw him, like, the next day, kind of, or maybe yeah. they, he helped move or, or something like that because our parents yeah. were, at least in front of us, I never saw them fight ever. Yeah, I never saw them fight. I never, yeah, and I, you know, give them shout out props for that. Of, yeah, yeah I definitely. Didn't, I didn't, I did not see them fight. And so, uh, yeah, and, and it was, I always, there were a couple other kids at school that, you know, were going through divorce or had been or whatever. And um, I was just like, oh, I have two houses. Like, I have a house where my mom <laughs> stays at and I have a house with my dad. So I thought I was, you know. I loved it too. You're right. Of, yeah. If I got two different of dynamics. One, you know, yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. yeah. Mm -hmm. So it wasn't like just, it really was mm -hmm. a, a shared custody. You know, I never, I don't know what the divorce paper said or whatever, but they seemed to. To, to make it work so um yeah okay it, so now we're back together again because that's how i saw it too in regard to my perspective on the whole thing is that okay i didn't see them together like you were able to see them and experience well first of all only child experience i've never felt as an only child you know so i didn't have that uh, perspective either but yeah i never really had felt traumatized until much later and maybe we'll get into it later but you're already old by that time you're i think you're already out of the home by this time when it really right. kicks in it's like hey we're not separated and we're not going to get back together da, da, da. that came at a crucial point in my life but for you it was like you probably already came to a realization or you kind of just i don't know were a little bit more at peace at least at that moment maybe you're busy because I think you're already in college at that time, maybe about a freshman. 
most likely. You no, know, you might have been high school. Uh, yeah, you might, no, you're, you right, you're right. I just graduated. I just oh, graduated. you just graduated. Right. Okay, just high graduated. school. You just graduated high school. You're right. Yeah, okay, you're right. yeah.